In this video, I'm going to show you how to embed a docx editor that runs completely inside a browser into your React app. This docx editor is able to open up uh, existing docx documents or create new docx documents without converting them to any intermediate formats or HTML uh, without any Microsoft Office or Libra dependencies. Now, to get started, uh, the best place is in docs.uprice.com. You can go ahead and navigate it, hit get started, pick the framework that you want. Today, we're going to be covering React. And for this specific example, I'm just going to go ahead and grab a ready to go example on GitHub uh, available here and just download the zip. Once I download the zip, I can go ahead and extract it uh, to this location. Once it's extracted and complete, I can go ahead and pop it open with my uh, VS Code. Inside of VS Code, I'm going to go ahead and open up the terminal and just uh, install all the necessary dependencies for this specific example. Now that I pulled it in, I'm able to go ahead and navigate to src app.js. And as you can see here, um, it's a simple app. And inside of our first use effect that runs on initialize, it instantiates the web year, and we're just go ahead and loading a specific document. Now, uh, also during the npm i installation, if you're kind of following this guide on your own, uh, as you can see that during it on the post install, it would actually go ahead and copy over the web year files that are necessary from the node modules to your public that are necessary for web year to operate. Okay, now we're ready. We can go ahead and run npm start. And this will go ahead and create a local server uh, running in our browser. And as you can see here, we have the PDF uh, rendered. Now here, I promise you that we're going to have this docx editor where I'm actually able to edit it. So I'm going to show you how you can turn this into the docx editor. So simply, let's go back to our code, open the app.js, and instead of the initial doc, and let's go ahead and remove all of this that we don't need. Um, we're going to go ahead and inside of the construction options, we're going to go ahead and pass in enable office editing set uh, to be true. And boom, all of a sudden on reload, now it actually initializes to be in, in editor mode. And inside of here, I can go ahead and create a new title, so heading, and I can start creating my uh, document. All right, if you're looking for a different framework, head on over to our YouTube channel where you can find how to get the docx editor in a number of different frameworks.